Come ride the little train that is rolling down the tracks to the junction. Forget about your cares, it is time to relax at the junction. Lots of curves, you bet. And even more when you get to the junction. Petticoat Junction. There's a little hotel called the Shady Rest at the junction. Petticoat Junction. It is run by Kate. Come and be her guest at the junction. Petticoat Junction. And that's Uncle Joe. He's a moving kind of slow at the junction. Petticoat Junction. too mad to talk. Well, we were just... No, I'll tell him. <laughs> this is what happened. A traffic ticket? You don't even have a car. It's for jaywalking. No kidding. What were you doing? Jaywalking. <laughs> I was not. All I did was cross the street from Peabody's ice cream parlor to Trindle's dry goods. Well, everybody does that. Yeah, we always go that way. Mom did it against the light. I did not. <laughs> I mean, that's what the officer put down on the ticket. Hey, wait a minute. Which one was it? The young one. You know, the one with the nice smile and the cute little back on his chin. <laughs> the mean, nasty-looking one. Wait a minute. What light? Oh, the Pixley Chamber of Commerce claimed they had so much traffic, they had to put in a light. And it runs during the peak hours, between 11 and 2 and 4 and 6. Oh, that pixely crowd. They just can't rest. You know, they've been jealous of Hooterville ever since we got that parking meter. <laughs> okay, give me the ticket. I'll take care of it. Oh. Due process law, bribe the sheriff. Uncle <laughs> Joe. Relax, Kate. It'll be handled right. The sheriff and me belong to the same lodge. Well, what's that got to do with it? Well, next month, us Campbells will have an installation. I happen to know the sheriff is bucking for a raise in rank. Right now, he's only a hump and a half camel. He wants to be a two-humper. It was just the right word for me. <laughs> Forget it. Okay. I am going to fight this fair and square. I've got justice on my side. Well, all right, if you want to go that route. Just remember, it'll never replace a few pats on the back and some cigars. <laughs> What's your defense, Mom? The truth. I know it was after two. Therefore, the signal should not have been running. But, Mom, the officer put down time of violation 155. A cute smile and a cleft chin doesn't make it right. <laughs> Just the one I wanted to see. Hey, wait till you get a load of today's Hooterville World Guardian. Oh? Yeah, uh, here. Now, sit down. Sit down. Now, I'm going to be right back. Oh, here. Have an apple. No charge. <laughs> this is one of the most exciting things that's happened to me since I've been in the publishing business. Here. What do you think of this? <laughs> What's that all about? Well, it's about your jaywalking ticket, that bum rap they gave you in Pitchley. Oh, you heard about it? Oh, it's all over the valley. That's why I had to get up early this morning and cancel my lead story about Grandma Tinsley winning second place in the Prune Cannon Festival. I must really be big. <laughs> yeah. Uh, here, uh, let, let me read it to you. <clears throat> to the average citizen, a traffic ticket is a minor irritation. But to Kate Bradley, when she knows she's in the right, it's a personal challenge. It's the U.S. Constitution, the Declaration of Independence, the Bill of Rights. It's 54-40-year fight. Pitch canoe and Tyler. Uh, you left out, I regret 
that I have but one life to give for my country. Oh, yeah. Well, maybe I can work that into the follow-up. <laughs> Sam, you're a character. Just a journalist trying to report the news as I see it. Well, I'm certainly glad that you see it my way. Oh, I don't. Because, you know, if you didn't... You what? I don't see it your way. But the paper, the big article. Oh, that's just the official stand of the Hooterville World Guardian upholding one of its subscribers against that Pixley crowd. You personally? Personally, I say forget it. Pay the two dollars. <laughs> Oh, hi, Kate. Floyd, did you hear what happened to me in Pixley? Oh, sure. And that I'm going to fight it? Yes, ma'am. Well, what do you think? Kate, you got a good head on your shoulders. Thank you, Floyd. One thing about you, you always think every problem through. Well, thank you, Floyd. And you always come up with the right decision. Thank you, Floyd. How come you blew this one? <laughs> 